So, it's been about a week since my last video. I made a video with Dr. EXE, aka Josh, on our new podcast. Um, I'd say it was pretty good. I'd say that there was probably some um, sound problems that we have to fix for the next one, but if you enjoyed it, uh, thanks for watching that one. Um, it was fun making that. So, this video is kind of about uh, a new up I got, you could say. Um, I got. Uh, I, I'm kind of making vids just to like, I'm trying to make more vids, see like, hey, what could I talk about? Hey, this is something I could talk about. Um, I recently got DG boots. Um, what can I say? They're DG boots. They're really good. Um, compared to an EDL pair of boots, you can see here. Uh, let's say these two. This um, this doesn't really matter until you get like a full set. But if we're going to stats, you can see that this has 50 heat damage. Which, if we're talking about like an EG boss, um, that's okay. Um, heat isn't especially great uh, on, let's say, Prot or Gelly, but Magic is definitely really good. Um, so let's say if these were both Heat, I'd still be getting 70 more damage, and it's Magic damage. And then there's also the 240 um, points split between Strength and Dex, which is 120 each. Then you have, you know, I think 50 less armor and then you have like around 60 less per resist and then I also have 400 defense like compared to the EDL but I just lose 115 health 225 energy that's fine and then um, uh, physical evasion is better it's I think it's fortitude and then the weakening attack evasion compared to wound wounding um, you, there's you get hit by more of these so this is good um, put this back on. Uh, this is what I've been kind of running recently. Just the normal Sun Ami. Uh, I, I usually am using this more for like, let's say, um, like Karamore bosses and uh, like BT. Um, but I'd say for like more like things you need to lock. So like let's say like Gelly. I would use a Sun Ami for the lock. But then right after we get lock, I'd throw on this because... On Gelly, if you don't have a lot of uh, Vit, you're going to die really easily. Uh, Gelly can hit up to like 5k on his, um, I forgot what it's called, but yeah. You get hit up to 5k, like the AoE. Um, so, with this, I also have, um, I put a reverb brace on for sustain, like just like not die instantly. Um, I switch out uh, my reaper ring for this divine ring, because divine it's good um and then i have this uh bt strength misc um and then i also recently have been using got i've been this is all things from the clan that they have trusted me to use um like this qs ring it's very good if i would go up to like let's say right here uh throw this Use QS instantly goes here, which is goes to two thirds, thirty. It's about thirty-three percent, which is you know one third. Uh, it's very close, and it's very good. Um, and I'm really happy to be using this. I don't know how much of an impact that would make the 120. I know it makes a lot, but um, I probably I'm not gonna tell. Uh, I've also recently been going towards Sun Ami just for the extra like 50 damage plus um yeah it's just for a lock it's for locks uh, I'd say for something like Prot I would just keep it on and hey look at this there's someone saying hey cool vid that's awesome I love that stuff I love people comment talk to me about rogues and stuff you don't even have to be a rogue just the game um, I feel like when you put this much time into a game, like people could say, oh, it's cringe that you, you care so much about the game. That's usually like uh, the same people who would be like who are playing just as much as you. 
like let's say in like another clan like attraction whenever they would lose they would complain and say well you guys just don't have lives i guess but the thing is we play around the same amount as each other um and it's a game you know people want to play a game let them play their game you know uh i don't know how it devolved into that i don't know why but um yeah but hey this guy he said something nice and that's nice um so something else to talk about which i don't i don't even know what to talk about to be honest uh i got this kite which is cool i think it's a six percent i got it for a decent price um yeah, 6%. Where, where'd it go? Here it is. Uh, I like that for the kite, it has a little effect on it. Um, I think all kites, 6 and above, have like different colors. I think Max is red. Uh, it has a red accent for a 15%. If I had a 15%, I'd just say I'd pay a lot of gold to get it. Um, but they just kind of don't exist like that, you know? They're just very, very rare. I was really lucky to find this one, especially for the price I got it at from a clan mate. Um, that was really nice. Uh, and I was thinking maybe I'd put on a tank, but honestly, I'll just keep it on me on this uh, just for like if I have Sun Ami on, because the extra health helps. Especially like I could take maybe like a shot or like maybe a. Sh I, I can get like at least one hit because when you just start off the prots if you want to like get off your QS and your SS quickly and your divine because like the sooner you can like put divine on the better for a lock but if you're very soon to like let's say if you like as soon as it pops if you're a rogue you can like shadow strike to it so you're probably one of the first ones to hit it so you're probably going to aggro uh, prod onto you which you're probably going to get a hit or two um I can maybe tank at tops like two and barely still be alive, um, but most likely it's one, and then I'll get hit killed by um, his uh, poison shield. Um, yeah, that's really bad for rogues when there's no wards on it, and you just because you auto so quickly, you keep taking that damage. Uh, <sighs> and yeah. But that's all the really news I got. Uh, um, but yeah, it's really cool to be part of Conk and uh, to get this item to use. The stats are really amazing on it, to be honest. Uh, just the extra 120 magic, it's, even, it's more than my Morty Helm. And comparing that from going from heat to magic is a really big jump. Uh, I'd say probably. I I don't know how it is for druids or mages, but I'd say for warriors and um, rangers compared to that for EGs, like what I'm, I'm talking about, like prot, uh, for sure D2 and um, what else? Gelly. They're all they're all like magic is very good on those, and uh, especially D2. And if you have all the pieces. For let's say uh, a DG, that's so much magic damage compared to heat that just does a lot of damage to D2 and prot and uh, Gelly. So yeah, I think that's the end of the vid. I recently uh, I haven't changed my mic, but I tweaked it a little bit uh, for a better sound. Um, if you like the sound better, uh, I'm not going to tell you to tell me. Um, I don't. Here's the thing too. I don't know especially who watches the videos I just kind of talk and be like hey what's up um, I make this kind of out of passion there's no gain I would say for making videos like this it's really just for newer players who want to play the game it's not like I'm especially saying things that are like it's not like I'm specifically saying things that are gonna like if you're just completely new to the game that's gonna help you but it's kind of like for the players who kind of been around a little bit um, I'd say if you're a new player and need to learn stuff about the game, just try to find somebody in a server you want to play on that knows what they're doing and try to like just, I guess, be friends with them. Uh, one, you get a friend, and two, you get somebody who you can play with. Um, having friends in the game uh, can 
means you can like play longer you have a reason to get on like if you didn't have any friends in the game you know if you're playing this game like let's say for me like a year straight uh i feel like some people with rpgs that get burnt out like especially rpgs they get burnt out uh I, i'd say that's that's with everything people get burnt out they get burnt out for their jobs they get they get it from like let's say other games let's say school uh this is a game though. It's supposed to be fun. Um, you just gotta treat it like a game. And yeah. So that's really probably the end. Um, there's not much more to talk about on my end. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching my vids. Um, if you do, uh, it's really cool to see people like say, "Hey, cool vid," like the guy from earlier, um, or somebody saying. I don't know just like talking about the vid saying it was cool it it makes me want to make more of them um, so yeah and another thing too if you have anything you want me to talk about that I could because I I'm not saying I'm the I know I'm not saying I know the most in this game you know but I know enough for my class and all the bosses to like kind of on the spot change something um, I know enough about the gearing to say what what would help a build. Like for me specifically, this is like the best I could think of. Um, I'd say even better than throwing this on here. Just in terms of a lock. Like just pure to damage. Because having the most... Um, how do I explain this? Just elemental damage to then throw on a tier 3 Bara, it gives me the most damage. So, just that. Um, but yeah, um, if you like these videos, you don't have to do anything. But if you're not subscribed, <laughs> I like how people say that, like, hey, can you subscribe to my video? I'm like, I'm not saying you have to subscribe, but, you know, hey, when I when I keep making videos and I see some type of progress, I'm like, hey, that's cool. Like, it, it's just a motivation type thing. And also, maybe one day you tune in you're like hey this, like he actually for one time made a good video you know I'm not saying this video is bad or anything but I want to get to a point where I can make better videos uh, like kind of like not saying more structured but more entertaining I could say that I can like keep talking and talking and at some point it can get kind of boring because a lot of youtubers nowadays they make videos that are kind of for people who don't have necessarily the longest attention spans like their time and everything they're like I want to see something like cool now like something get my attention um, and my I think my videos are more kind of just not a really an attention grabber and that's why people could be like oh, I'm kind of done watching this someone has to be probably pretty bored to like sit through a whole vid but um, if you do, thank you. And uh, that's probably going to be end, end. That's probably going to be the end of the video. I've been talking very fast. I don't know why. Um, maybe because I'm finally making videos in the daytime, like normal time. Uh, so yeah, later.